Hey, what's up guys? I haven't done a sit down uh, vlog recently and I am back as you can clearly see. I have got a bit of a different background, a bit of a change in camera um, and I am going to be turning my uh, channel, which is going to be vlogs, LGBT stuff, travel vlogs, but also pop culture news for you guys, like daily uh, vlogs, Monday to Friday, to sort of talk about what the hell is going on in this world, and I'm going to bring you guys some really awesome content uh, coming soon. But today, uh, I'm assuming some of you have heard the craziness that is Kevin Spacey. Uh, it was alleged over the weekend that Anthony Rapp, an actor who is uh, big in theatre as well as on the new Stargate Discovery series on CBS as well as on Netflix. In a statement posted on Twitter, Kevin Spacey says, I have a lot of respect and admiration for Anthony Rapp as an actor. I'm beyond horrified to hear this story. Um, to hear his story. I honestly do not remember the encounter. It would have been over 30 years ago, but if I did behave, then as he describes, I owe him the sincerest apology for what had been what would have been a deeply inappropriate drunken behavior, and I am sorry for the feeling he describes having carried with him all these years. The story has encouraged me to address other things about my life. I know that there are stories out there about me, and there are some have been fueled by the fact that I have been so pr protective of my privacy as those to closest to me know in my life i've had relationships with both men and women i have loved and had romantic encounters with men throughout my life and i choose how now to live as a gay man i want to deal with these honestly and openly that starts examining my own behavior okay with this statement i have uh, like serious issues with that because it does sound like that he is sort of uh, basically saying he's coming out and then he's throwing people off the center of the story. Using Sarah Kate Ellis from um, from Glad the Gay Lesbian Alliance Against Defamation who tweeted out something amazing who said um, coming out stories should not be used to deflect from allegations of sexual assault. This isn't a coming out story about Spacey but a story of survivorship by Anthony Rapp and those who speak out against unwanted sexual advances. Yes! That's so good. So after Anthony Rapps uh, spoke to BuzzFeed, um, he then tweeted out a whole bunch of tweets saying, I came forward with my story standing on the shoulders of the many courageous women and men who have been speaking out to shine a light and hopefully make a difference as they have done for me. Everything I wanted to say about my experience is in that article and I have no further comment at this time. Netflix has now come out saying that House of Cards, which was meant to have slated for its last season to begin in uh, next year. It's now been completely canned, which is unfortunate because I really liked the show and I thought um, it was such a great show and I really would have loved to have seen the end. Um, but yeah, so my personal thoughts for this is that I have a lot of different issues with this. Not on Anthony Rapp's side, but as um, on Kevin Spacey's side. The reason why is I think that this does pro, um, project a lot of stereotypes a wrong gay man, and people might use this. I hope they don't, and I really hope that people don't. But that, again, sort of shows the fact that I think a lot of the archaic stereotypes around this. So the way that I think Ke uh, Kevin Spacey actually produced his um, apology was going back to those very old stereotypes, which we've, as the community and also through different advocacy groups we've actually tried to destroy because they're just completely defunct and completely stupid. As for as for Anthony, I really I really commend him for coming out and, and saying this. Um, it's really, really fantastic because the more we shine a light on this, the more chance we actually have from getting these sort of people out of Hollywood. But I think Philip DeFranco says it best, of course he's the amazing YouTuber who says um, whether or not this is actually going to change everything or if it's just throwing out a couple of bad eggs for sort of and then life to resume as normal uh, or before the Harvey Weinstein thing broke. But no, guys, I want to hear your thoughts. Uh, what do you think about the whole um, thing with Kevin Spacey? Um, what do you think about the response? What do you think about the response in the media? And I will see you guys uh, tomorrow with a new video and I'll see you guys later. Bye.